How's it going everybody? Joshua August here. Happy Christmas Eve. It's definitely one of my favorite nights of the year. I love the feelings, the vibes. I love the Lord. I love, uh, you know, children's books the night before Christmas. I almost read a book today, you know, I wanted to do that, but I think God had different plans. Uh, my ideas really weren't coming together like I thought, but I have something cool to share and I wanted to do a video every day this week. I'm like, I'm doing a video. I don't care how busy I am. I'm going to make it happen. And as you can see, I got my Christmas sweater. That's right. Do you see that? In all of its glory. I went to you know the store to get one and they just weren't that great this year. But this one was the only one left really and it was my size. And I've actually lost two sizes. Hallelujah. Thank you. But anyways, I gotta stay true to family too. You know, I gotta get back up and spend time with my family because that's what's most important. But fight for the festive spirit, guys. Uh, fight for family during this time and I just think about like you know the Great Depression I think about the violinists I don't know why I'm showing you because you don't know right I'm thinking about the violinists on a Titanic who were playing not that we have it that bad but we still even if you don't feel like it you still push forward write that Christmas song there's still time I don't want to hear it from you musicians because I worked over a hundred hours in the last two weeks two weeks yeah that's right and I still wrote one. And I do all this video work myself. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying. So write yourself a song. It'll, in an hour, you can come up with something. Let's be real. And I'm just going to stand with those who need a miracle. And just, I don't know if you caught it in my last video, but I said there was a card within a card. So the person was expecting, hey, just a card, but what? There was a surprise inside. So I want you to just stand and expect that. Uh, but for me, I think it's been more of a provision month. I found something today that God always speaks to me through. I'm not going to share it because it's between me and my my sweetie. Yep, that's right. That's what I call him. Uh, but I found that today and provision came through, did it not, for the holidays. So that's what was for me and for some of you. But if you need a miracle, still stand with you. And something else rocked my world today. I saw that quote. I posted it uh, from Nick Vujasek. I think that's how his name is. But he said, if you didn't get a miracle, then be a miracle. And we can all do something for somebody. And, and you don't even have to spend money, you know, to be a blessing. And that happened to me today. And it just rocked my world at work. I had to work today. Yep. Mm -hmm. But uh, someone, you know, a, you know, a customer came in or whatever. And he had a really cool name. I'm not going to share it. I was a little jelly. Mm -hmm. But um, I was like, man, that sounds like a famous person. And him and his friend just looked at each other and laughed and I was like man I just see you like going up on stage to win a Grammy or something like that I'm like you like music and he's like they just start laughing he's like yeah yeah you know that's my dream and his one friend looked at me kind of suspicious like what are you up to you know doesn't know about the prophetic whatever so then God told me what kind of music you liked and I was like how about R&B he's like I love R&B and I was like what about like Chance the Rapper you know kind of like stuff and he's like that's exactly what I want to do so that was a blessing. It was a small miracle confirmation, and I encouraged him to go after his dreams. You know, I know what all what that's all about musically. You know, and they just were laughing and rolling. And this was at work, so I couldn't be like, I was tempted to get him saved or whatever. You know, that's how I roll. Um, but I just sowed that seed and blessed them, and uh, I was I was the Lord to them today, and it didn't cost me anything. And you can do that too. And shamelessly, I'm gonna agree and pray. Let's pray for a two thousand, a two K. Uh, stimulus check okay let's just stand together the word says if two or more agree and touch anything on earth watch yep that's a sound effect mm -hmm. that's happening I'm serious 2k is way better is greater than <laughs> 2k is greater than 600 so we just agree and receive that because I can't explain to you what I saw, God's goodness and love, how he wanted to bless America and the people financially. And I've been saying a wealth transfer for years, for years. And for all you people who are like, oh, uh, prosperity gospel, um, everyone in heaven gets a mansion. And Jesus said, there are many mansions in my father's house. If it were not so, I would have told you. No, it's not all about that. But God is good and he's not cheap. When he does something, he does it well, just like that provision story. Or that miracle with that woman, she got a nice car, and he even shipped it. Okay, shipping and handling, that's how God rolls the very best. And anyways, this scripture kind of rocked me today. These scriptures, Isaiah 1, 17 through 19. Let's take a look. Do good, defend the fatherless, help the widow, 
And in the 19, if you are obedient, you'll eat the good, you know, the good fruit of the land, the good of the land. Isn't that an amazing promise? But what's the key? If we got to be obedient to the Lord, there's a time to sow, there's a time to reap, like that person who got the vehicle, you know, but um, let's do good, let's be obedient, walk into, you know, favor with the Lord. And lastly, someone very special is on my heart today. It just hit me deep, and I just felt uh, such love for you. You're just such a deep person, and uh, maybe the holidays, you know, everyone's kind of like wondering, you know, if, if you're single or things like that. I never, I don't ever talk about this kind of stuff. Uh, but the person you'll end up with, they, they're thinking about you too. And I'm not like prophesying, you know, marriage and all that kind of stuff, which I'm not against either. But uh, the person you're missing is missing you too. And they're going to be loyal to you. They're going to love you like you deserve and like you've never, I feel God right now, so deep. And it hit me so deep today. Whoever you are, you're such a deep person. And they're going to love you like you need to be loved. And I hope you're ready because they're going to rock your world. Be blessed. Merry Christmas. And I'm going to do a video tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Bye. All right, fine. I'll try and make the impression. It's really not my thing, but gosh, gosh, Pluto. Whoa, whoa. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. How'd I do? And how, not how, but what is your favorite Christmas song? I'm really curious. Uh, today, I, I can't, mine changes. If you really love music, your songs change, but uh, do you hear what I hear was my jam today. What's yours? Christmas time is here.